Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Hades 2. We're jumping in again. We've just upgraded everything and selected our powers. We're going to go in with the starting weapon, the witch, uh, the witches, whatever it's called. I can't remember the name of it now. Um, the witch's staff. And in terms of these, I think we're going to go for the pick again for a bit. Let's let's grab the pick. Yeah, we're going to go for the pick again for a bit because that's been pretty useful. And I want to get the, the uh, fishing rod at some point soon as well. But let's jump in and see what we can do with this run and hope for a, hope for a good time. We are really close to beating the um, Cerberus boss, but not quite there. Lightning. We like it. Cerberus Rainfall. Yes. Your attacks inflict blitz. That's pretty great. Sprint causes nearby first to be struck by lightning. Or we can go with Magicka Regen, but it would just reduce our Magicka by a, a hefty amount. Let's just go with the Blitz first, I think. That's a, a pretty good way to start out. Enemies get Lightning Strike after a certain amount of time. We're going to try and grab as much Ash as we can here. Yeah, that was pretty good stuff. We'll grab that as well while we're here. I love the range that we have on this, and then we've, we've shown before how Poseidon with that ability is insane. So we'll try and pick that up again if we can. That was something quite unbelievable last time we had it. There you go. Good thing is with this uh, Blitz, I can just kind of leave enemies after. Ooh, definitely take that. Like, I can hit those enemies. I can just kind of leave them to get Blitzed. I think it's after I deal a certain amount of damage, actually, not rather than leaving them. Yeah, it is. Okay. So it's not it's not that, that I leave it. It's that I just keep attacking them and it'll do big damage after a certain amount of time. Which on these weaker enemies isn't really that useful. But later down the line, it'll prove to be invaluable. Oh, I didn't realize you were attacking me there. My bad. Dumb damage there. It's okay. We'll heal it up. Plenty of work. Ooh, that would remove that. Okay, I didn't realize that would be the case. Um, you take minus 10% damage and restore some magic whenever you take damage. That seems great. Honestly, just minus 10% damage on its own is very, very good. Doesn't seem like a lot, but it can be the difference. Okay, once you're delightenified, we can get you with a blitz. Lovely. Thank you. Daedalus off the bat. Yes, please. Daedalus early is always good. Potentially makes some of our other attacks a bit more pertinent. Good, good, good. There you go. The blitz does a lot there. These guys can be a little annoying when there's groups of them, but luckily, when they don't have armor, they're not so bad. Attack uh, deals 40% damage and can also strike sideways. Interesting. Your attack hits two times, but no longer strikes behind you. Ooh, that seems pretty good. Special gains a power shot that deals 20% damage and restores five. Yeah, let's go with that. I like the restoring mana on that. I saw 15 life now. What's our life at? Nah, we won't, we won't bother doing that. Your next world Charon item with duration instead expires after two guardians. And sure, the next boon has upgraded rarity. Oh, I don't have enough money for that. It's okay. Um, we have no money left, actually. Oh, man, these fucking shadow spillers are awful, man. I hate them. I get hit by them so goddamn often. Should have taken the restore life, shouldn't I? I'm confused. What's going on with my mana? Is that actually doing damage to him? I don't think it is. I think I can only deal damage when I'm in the shadow. 
Oh no, it's just that this is doing like no damage to him. Oh, bugger off with that attack. I can never predict it. <laughs> and it's, oh my God, the range on it's insane as well. This mini boss, I hate him. Go away. Do not like that thing. Special inflict uh, does more damage inflicts freeze. Okay, let me let me just see what's going on with this. Your special gains a power shot that deals plus twenty percent damage and restores five. No, not that. What's, what's the power shot? I'm, I'm, I'm confused. <laughs> I am confused. I am very confused how I deal the power shot to restore my mana. Is it just... Just using it restores mana, but it says restores five. I'm confused. Do I have... Oh, I have passive regen on, don't I? I don't, I don't know how to use this power shot at all. Is this the power shot? It doesn't seem to restore any mana. Your special, which is this one, triangle, yes, gains a power shot that deals plus 20% damage and restores 5 mana. But how the fuck do I use it? I'm so confused. Like, it's clearly not this. This, isn't re this doesn't restore any mana. because, But this uses mana. Very confused. I don't, I don't really know what to think. Do you like the freezing, though? Freezing's very nice. Should be the last of them. Yeah, take care of you. And you. Oh my god, when these guys have armor, they fire so many more shots. I think that was a waste of time, honestly. I don't think it's really done anything for us. Good. More ashes. We need as many ashes as we can get to open up all those tablets. Nemesis. Oh, hello. What? Missed all the fun. Nemesis, what are you doing here? They'll manage. I'm on break. Tell Hecate you saw. Okay. I don't need your aid in this. Other than the responsibilities you've already been assigned. Really? Look like you could use all the aid you can get. Oh, hello. I don't know what that is. What have you just given me? Get lost. Did she Whenever you are um, struck, take no damage and lose one of these. Okay. Seems useful. Should be useful. Short chaos gate spawns. Damn, we need more money. Sealed shut. Don't, don't really know what I'm doing wrong with this. If anyone can work that out, let me know, but I'm unsure. I resisted one hit there because I was stupid and didn't think I was going to get hit. How dumb of me. Okay, Palmer Power. Blitz damage is good. Let's go with extra magicka restored. You again. I got a terrain kill there. Didn't even mean to. Good. 
Good, good. And then we've got some uh, stuff we can mine here. Oh, why not? Just get it in the middle of combat, why not? I do like the fact that that has some good AoE on it. Some very good AoE. But I don't see it doing the extra damage and stuff. Ooh, okay, I think we have to go for max HP here. We do not have the money for a shop right now. Right, boss isn't going to be super easy here, I wouldn't think. Ah. Hey, Hecate. There's not much glory in confronting adversaries one to one. I myself invoke shades of the dead to alter the odds. Some may well favor you instead. Perhaps if I brought with me a legion of animal familiars next time, headmistress? You jest, yet a familiar may be of considerable benefit. Can I get that cat as a familiar? A possibility to think upon once you are rid of me. Crossed flames burn. Okay, this is doing a good amount of damage. We're liking that. Oh, and I got a crit with it there as well. Total eclipse. Okay, where's your summons? Resisted a hit there. Didn't really mean to get hit by that. It was a very low damage one to resist, to be honest. Luckily, I restore a ton of mana when I get hit, so... Damn it. Taking some very stupid hits right now. Ah, uh, no, you can't! That was some bullshit. Did two attacks in one there. Ow. I've never seen her do the uh, transmog while doing that other attack before. Gotcha. Sorry I go so quiet in that fight, but honestly, I'm still laying this fight, and every different weapon, every different build is, changes it so much. To keep things livelier for me. Faith of familiar spirits. Ooh. The cat. Give me the cat. Unfortunately, we lost quite a lot of HP there. Not ideal. Oh, here he is again. Hello. Persist, despite my generous attempts to dissuade you. Then very well. You carry on as the distraction which you are, whilst I turn my attention to matters of greater import. Okay. Oh. A death cap. Good, good, good. Oh, we got a chaos gate in here. Yes, please. As long as I've got the HP, Chaos Gates are always going to be worthwhile. Also, I want the law. <laughs> Give me that goddamn law. I can gift to you. If you'll permit me, Almighty Chaos, I wish you to have this gift of nectar in accordance with my family's custom among relatives and friends. None of this would have been possible if not for you. I shall grant you this wish and the freedom to bestow upon me further gifts as you see fit. For I have familiarity with this custom of yours and am prepared to reciprocate. Beautiful stuff. Whatever this is. Transcended embryo. When I created life, I had my doubts. Or would it invite more problems than it solved? I would be curious to see. As my experiment continues to unfold, its outcome very uncertain. Almighty chaos, with your experiment so vast in scope, what can one individual achieve? The quandary you mentioned when first we met. What would you have me do? 
So on the Hades, I ought to clarify, I do not care, but I will talk. Ask me no questions. Respond only when prompted, or when necessary, in the absolute. But above all, do as you will. No chit chat. Right. Next two boons you find are limited to common blessings. After your, Afterwards, you channel your move 17% faster. Um, for the next five locations, rewards are hidden. Afterwards, when you exit a location, you restore three. Um, ooh. I'm going to go for the hidden rewards. It seems, it seems bad. But... Oh, uh, uh, this is unfair. I do not like this. Oh my lord, can you chill out? God damn, that was difficult. Um, four encounters restore fifty percent HP. Valuable enough. Give me some limestone as well. Right, doesn't matter which one of these we take. We don't know what we're getting. Take out the one that's on his own over here. Ah, these bloody fucking fish things. I got that. There's a lot of enemies that I really don't like on this floor. Unless you're hitting these things constantly. They just barrage you non-stop. Okay. Luckily, they're not armored, at least. The armored ones are much, much worse. Sister Selene. Oh, that's actually pretty good. What does saluting do? Is saluting worth anything? My droid, I am obliged. Lend me your light. I held to faith your task would not require you above, only below. But Hermes indicates the threat here on the surface now looms larger than we thought. Rise to us, then, whenever time permits. Your Hex restores 25% uh, 25 HP three times, uh, which resets whenever you use fountains. I think I'm going to go for the healing. Healing's just too good. At the minute, I'm not, I'm not super strong yet. Honestly, I'm not super strong. This attack's decent, but not like the best. A bunch of fish are going to spawn after this, aren't they? Oh god. One second. Phone call incoming. Okay, we are back. Sorry about that. I had to go collect a package, but goddamn, it is an absolutely beautiful, beautiful day outside. So I am definitely gonna go out for a walk after this, I think. Vitality. Can I strike these with a bunch of lightning? Oh, I didn't realize they actually swung at you. But it's something I am unaware of. Lord Hermes. Ah, Hermes. Wasn't expecting you, but I'll take it. I love the way he speaks really quickly as well. Just keeping tabs on everyone, I guess. Why, thank you. Specials. Okay, that's pretty good. Dodge chance is nice too. Um, I'm going to go with this, the 15% extra on our special, because we're using that quite a lot. Right. Let's go in here. How many more encounters have we got to go? Got one more encounter on two of them. Oh yeah, that speed is noticeable. Apparently I knew how to get my mana back with this.
Just stand back and smash, because this thing does great damage. Right. I mean, we don't really have a choice here, so let's just take this one, I guess. I wonder if those locked ones are actually any better. So we now heal three after every location, I think. Which is pretty incredible. Oh, dude, those crits are really nice. We do have enough to use our healing here, but we're about to get a 50% heal, I think. From one of the Kronos things we grabbed. So I don't want to do that right now. I like the way it has the moon above your head to signify that it's available, though. That's very nice of the game to do that for us. Okay, good. All of those dead. We've got pretty big AoE on our attacks as well, which is kind of nice. Smashed. There you go. We got a bunch of healing. We got that. And then the, the, we got one left by the looks of it. Ah, right, okay. We, still, we just need a well at Karen item. Okay, so we can see our stuff now. We'll go for, um... We'll go for more freezing. We've got a bit of Demeter already. I think going for more Demeter is a good idea. Oh, man. Oh, we got a well at Karen here. That's good. Okay, freeze him and then wail on him, I think. If we can. There's so many of them, though. Maybe take out the ones that are kind of in the corner over here on their own. This is just an area with just these, isn't it? God damn it. I really wish they could explode each other, but I guess it kind of makes sense that they can't. Still slightly annoying, though. Okay, there's two of them dead of crit there. Did a good job for us. Get out of there. One more. Hazard, wouldn't it? Okay, just a weapon to die. Come on, Demeter. Give us something we need. Oh, well, we've got an infusion one here. Why have at least six? You cannot take more damage per hit. Oh, that's amazing. Although we'd have to build towards that. Um, I'm going to take that and then try and take some dirt ones, earth ones, whatever you want to call them, later, which could take a while, but that seems amazing. Um. Both of those are really good. They're extended for two guardians. We'll go for this. We've not got a lot of money left. Thank you for that. And then it will this be good to us? Your cast. Oh, that's kind of good, but we don't use that cast very often. I'm going to go with that. Impervious for eight seconds upon entering an area. Not always going to be that useful, but could be. Good, good. Okay. Boss time. Don't know how I feel about boss here. But we shouldn't die, at least, which is good. Indeed, it's me again. That you don't listen to yourself explains a lot. I know better than to try and kill an Oceanid, former or not. I just need you to get out of my way. Hear that, gals? I distinctly heard the lady say, I need you there. <laughs> Our art changes lives. What say we change this one right now? One, two, three, four. Alright, so we're impervious for a little bit here, so we might as well just wail on her for a bit. Unfortunately. We don't have the most damage with this build. I absolutely love the music on this. Resisted that. Lovely. Okay, we're starting to take damage now. Yeah, unfortunately our damage really isn't that great. If we get crits and stuff, it can be decent. Close. 
Yeah, I saw that one coming. Good thing is, as well here, if we do get hit, we gain a ton of mana back. I'm hoping we don't get hit, but if we do, mana is returned to us. Let's go for you for a little bit. Seems like this one's the easiest to wail on. Luckily, we're regening mana all the time. Having that as a, as a permanent power now is really nice. Okay, we got about halfway. Just keep wailing on it. Good, good. Who's got the encore? Oh, it's you, is it? I've not seen her be the featured artist before. I actually know I have. I have one time. I've seen this before. Okay. It's weird, we got all this healing and then we, we've had our best fight ever of just not getting hit at all. Ah, oh, bollocks, this is gonna hit us, isn't it? Oh no, we just about escaped it. Actually, it takes ages for that to strike. Go back to the drummer. Still don't know what these orbs actually end up doing to us, but let's not find out. Good, good. Honestly, I'm in such focus mode. I apologize the commentary is a little lacking in this episode. I'm in such focus mode on this attack right now. Okay, there's one of them dead. Oh, we got hit there, but that just means we get a ton of mana back. I wonder if I can kill her first. I'm going to try that. Ow. Unfortunately, I'm taking a lot of damage now. Let's uh, let's get a heal going, shall we? We go like this. There you go. Very nice. Okay. She is... Impervious for a little bit here. You're not the. Okay, you're gonna start spawning all your fish friends now, which spells trouble for us. So... Just wail on her. There you go. Don't worry about the damage, just wail on her. Oh, that was a very good fight against them, uh, considering our damage wasn't super high. I like it. We're getting plus six heal after there. Okay. Down we go again. It's a good run so far. It's a good run. It's drier here at least. Fields and morning. That it is. Oh, lovely. Lovely. We like that. Remember we're going for ground abilities. Never take more than fifteen damage seems insanely useful. Oh, what the fuck? Who slash what are you? You're a big rolling stone head. You're dead now, though. Into the purse. Right, let's grab that and then go. <laughs> I kind of like the fact that you can do that. More max HP here is great. We've kind of been wanting some of that. Lots of these folk. Lots and lots of these folk. God damn. You were just frozen. Okay, they weren't too bad at all, actually. It's cleared up. There you go. Max life. Very, very good. That's our that's our way out. I wanna go over this way somewhere, don't we? There's a little bit of max HP there. Plus five, it's not bad.
Okay. Be careful of those freaks with their punches. I actually managed to kill most of them there. And then this one's frozen. I like the freeze into the lightning bolt. That's a, a good way to play this. Even though it only does 120 damage, it's not a lot. It's a good way to lock them down there. And we get the pliers. Have we gifted to you yet? I don't know if we have, so I'm going to give it a go. Lord Hephaestus, your services must be in very high demand. I should have just checked my book, really. Look, I don't work for tips. The world's ain't an ordinary arrangement. And then often they get new regular clients. To it. Call it a trade. Nice. Okay. For this Hephaestus, Adamant Shard. I'm down for that. On my authority. Um, okay. It's not a lot of bonus life. I'm gonna give it a go though. Come it's something at least. Here. I think we are finished here. Well, I don't know, this one this seems kind of obvious. <laughs> this is kind of obvious which one to go for here. Just wanna check. That was a ground one as well, yeah, I thought it was. Oh god! Ah, uh, fucking stop sucking me! Not a sentence I thought I'd be saying today, but the the this fucking thing is awful. Get it out of my life. Get it out of here. I do not want the suck. That thing just chases you down until it hits you, essentially. Okay, stay up there, you. Thank you. Right, give me that. What the hell is this? Glass rock. Oh, that's new. So there. And reveal my path. Ah! I was saying before how it, there needs to be something that tells you where they are. It's good to know that exists. Ah. Okay, got a lot of these things to deal with. Honestly, just trigger them all and get the hell out of there. I actually think that did damage to them all, to be honest. Get one of them dead. The other two are kind of moved away a little bit, that's fine. Didn't freeze both of them, unfortunately. That did the lovely. Bit of a weaker build than we're normally used to, but this has been decent. Thank you, Zeus. Um... Deal damage even if they expire without being activated. Um, when your blitz effects activates, a bolt of chain lightning fires from the foe. Yeah, that's decent enough. I don't think there was any uh, land ones there, was there? Should have looked. I keep I keep forgetting to look at that. Oh my god, it's Punchy McGee. Yeah, punchy, punchy, get off me. Do not like the punchy boys, they're very, very strong. Luckily we broke his armor pretty quickly there. I don't actually really know what these guys do for attacks, to be honest. I've not really seen them attack much. I need to use these trees more often. They're pretty good. Good, good. The pliers. We want to go for the earth one, remember? After you enter a location, prime 30 to gain 10 armor until the next location. It's decent enough. Right, let's have a little look, see what we're on here. We currently have 5 out of 6, nice. I've drawn them out. Okay. These witch women are uh, kind of a weird one. They're not that hard, but it's like when you're fighting a lot of other stuff, they become a little 
a little bit of a nuisance. Especially when you've got something where you need to stand still to charge it up. Okay. Smack, smack, smack. Good, good. Extra mana there to make up for the reserve mana that we just got. And then... <sighs> this is difficult. I don't want to fight a mini-boss. But, if I could get a ground one from Zeus, although will Zeus give us any Earth-related effects? Do we have any Earth-related effects from Zeus already? No, we don't. So I don't think I don't think Zeus is really going to give us any Earth-related effects, to be honest. So let's go for this. Bit of a risk. I'd love to activate the other one, but I just doubt Zeus is going to do that for us. And she seems pretty useful. Is that you? Is that you? Is that, is that you? you? Is that you? It's me, all right, Echo. I don't know how come you've been assisting me, but I'm a long way from home and could use all the help I can get going farther. Help going farther. Yes. Father. Right. Again, a random boon from the previous night. Interesting. Uh, manifest a copy of my most recently claimed reward. Gain 50% life based on their limits, but lose. Okay, let's try this. I'm grateful. We got Slippery, a splash effect from Poseidon. Okay, that's not great considering we don't have any effects from Poseidon. So, doesn't really help us that much. Thank you nonetheless. Okay. I guess we'll go with this. Right, let's see if we can find that tree. I mean, first of all, we found the Daedalus straight away, so that helps. Okay, good. I don't know what these guys do if they're armoured. Well, let's not find out. Yeah, I feel like I underused the sprint, but at the same time... I don't know, do you guys you guys that are playing this, do you guys sprint much? I feel like the sprint is a bit cumbersome to use. Okay, that was some bad damage there, but... We've got armour right now, so it's fine. Some really bad damage there. Dude, can you chill out, please, with your armor and stuff? My god, you are annoying. And you are as well, to be fair. You keep moving away from me. Now for what's mine. The Daedalus. Your attack has more range. 50% damage to distant first. That's pretty good. Um... Your special fires two projectiles that seek foes. Okay, that seems very, very good. A sturdy staff indeed. Okay, so that, I think that only counts for the smaller one. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, fucking stop with your sucking. Oh my, I fucking hate these enemies, man. This, this does seem pretty good, to be fair, actually. The two projectiles and stuff. I didn't expect it to be so good. The fact that it freezes, and we can just keep on doing it. It's, it's, it's like small damage, but stacks up. Right, here's this. Yeah, it's kind of one of the things that you don't want to be using unless there's only a few small enemies left, or like, a single boss or whatever. Let's heal that, why not? The good thing is it homes, so we can just kind of like look wherever and fire it and it'll eventually make its way towards the enemies we're looking to attack. It's got limited range though, so we can't do that from any distance. 
Can you attack the right enemy, please? Right, you two need to slow your roll and stop. You're annoying the hell out of me. There you go. Right, give me an Earth one, please. Olympus, I accept this message. No Earth ones, god damn it. Um, fifty percent dodge chance to dodge. Yeah, I think we go for the dodge chance. That seems useful. I hear it over here somewhere. So this is the tree. Show me the way. There you go. We got one of those shadow spinner things. It's apparently slowly encroaching on me. If it could bugger off, that'd be really nice. I don't realize it'd be able to move so fast. Fucking Shadow Spinner, bugger off! Man, those things are evil. Just fucking go away. Oh my god, nobody likes you, Shadow Spinner. Luckily, these guys aren't really that bad. They do deal initial damage on throwing it at you, though. Only a little bit, but... It's enough to be an annoyance. Okay, good. We've also got some, uh, some of this over here. Which I'll just grab. And then run. Right. Take me to the door. Shop max HP. Ooh, I'll take that. Hail, boatman. Good, good, good. If only you could see my fields in the morning sun, shining brighter than any. Gold. Give me some earth base, please. Yes! After this location, prime a barrier that absorbs one instance of damage. Magicka prime 20. The strength of Earth. Awesome. So this is finally activated now, whichever one it is. Where is it? There you go. We've got six. You can only ever take 15 damage in a hit. This is great for the boss. I want to see what having two of these does. Is it just a different choice? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. what is this? You can use your Hex plus one time before using a Fountain. Yes, please. Um, oh, we've got three to use here. Uh, your Hex resource, extra health. Um, your Hex resource, Magicka. Hmm, interesting. Ah, oh, I should have gone for that. That was stupid of me. That was stupid of me. Oh well. Hello, hello. This is our best possible attempt yet. Now we've no fewer than three mighty sons of Nyx within our ranks. Granted, one's always fast asleep. Forgive me, I must not have understood. Hypnosis is of greater use this way. Ah, he has power while he's asleep, maybe something like that. But th this this is the best attempt we've ever had of this boss, so we should be able to beat him here. The only thing is, we don't have the most damage, so it is going to be a bit of a, a lengthy one. I think honestly, this is going to be the best way to fight this guy. Try and use the big balls when we can, but they're a little more risky. Mostly just spam the hell out of this. It does sort of... Oh, uh, who the fuck are you? Barrier resisted. I'm going to have to kill you very, very swiftly. I 
So I do not want to trifle with you, please. Oh, that wasn't good. I only got 10 damage there. Not so bad. I don't know how much damage that does. But his attacks do like 30 damage, so chopping it down to maximum of 15 ever is huge for us. It's just going to be a slow burn is all. Good thing as well we have good healing on our side. We're very defensive. Not very offensive. I mean, also, this is just good because the, the longer the fight takes, the more we learn the fight. So, in that way, it's pretty decent. I wonder if there's any reason to go for some Storm here. I don't really think there is, is there? Okay. We're getting him near to halfway. Ah, I'm stupid. Only took 12 damage, so I've got to remember as well, 15% damage with 10% reduced off the top. So we're only taking 12 damage there, even better. Honestly, this is kind of amazing. And also him being frozen just means his attacks are slower as well, which is nice. He hasn't done the flamethrower thing yet, but I think that's only after halfway. There you go, like this. Okay, we do not like these. Honestly, this is going to be where we lose most of our HP here. For a while there, they weren't both attacking us at once, and I was like, thank goodness they can't attack us at once. They soon changed their tune about that. take out one to start with. Okay. This wasn't too bad. The wolf enemies are kind of annoying, but this wasn't so bad. Okay, I made a mistake here. Wasn't really much I could do to avoid that, but now we can do this at least. Just our 35 HP. Don't know why I decided to do that there. Okay, let's let's try and focus up a little bit here, because I'm taking some really dumb damage. Another 35 healed. I think this, this arena being so much bigger and having so many more attacks is going to be harder. Like, a lot harder. It's okay, though. It's working. The fireballs. So many of them. Uh, he's keeping us at range as well, which is definitely not helping. Extra lightning bolt on him there, why not? Once again, th this one's really rough because I'm going to have to get out of the way of him. Yeah, and that which doesn't really work. Okay, he's just going to keep going with that, is he? Got me, but only just. Ah, god damn it. The range on some of his attacks is way bigger than you expect. Just getting used to that. Just sprint. Why not sprint?
Right. We've nearly got him. Remember, we've got plenty of death defies left and health. Get over here. Don't try to stand in the little middle bit. That's futile. We've learned that already. Oh my god. <laughs> Towards the end here, he gets fucking insane. Lightning's good when I can make it work. There you go, baby. Oh, man. Oh, there you go. There's the Cerberus we know and love. It's really you. Having shed its coat of torment, the soul-devouring infernal beast beyond the gates of Tartarus reveals that it is not the monster it appeared, but one more infamously vicious still. Beast soothed. Awesome. Where did he go? Little old Cerberus. Okay. No idea what's up next. He was We're scared. Authorized personnel only. Definitely scared. Ooh, unseal. No is this the is this gonna be the boss fight? Is this gonna be the final boss? I reckon it is. Now. On my authority as Princess of the Underworld. Excellent. I'm not prepared for this, whatever it is. Trouble. Oh, Hello. you're here. What are you doing here in Tartarus? <laughs> There's no way you could have access to this place unless unless I could like fly. Come off it, babe. You're way too stuck in your own head. You'll probably be stuck here too. Oopsie. Ah, the curse. <laughs> We've got to do three lo three things of this location before we can uh, Central control. get out. Just need a moment. There. Express route set. You oh, that's a trap. On Don't even remotely know what to expect here, but I'm sure it's going to be scary. Yeah, our damage is pretty pitiful, unfortunately. Luckily, like I said, our defenses are very, very high. Oh, there's one right in front of me. I was wondering why I wasn't able to hit those guys behind. Oh god, they, they've like froze me in time? Ah, he's literally just freezing you. Okay, it doesn't do any damage. You just don't want to get caught in that when they explode. Is that it? Nope, that is, that is definitely not it. Yeah, I really wish we had more damage for this. Unfortunately, this is one of my weakest builds I've ever had, but my mo one of the most defensively strong builds I've ever had as well. It's a weird one. Dude, this is a really long area. What the hell's going on? Oh, it freezes the enemies too. Oh, these guys are the shield dudes. I was wondering what, why we hadn't seen these shield dudes yet. Because in the last game, there was uh, an area that had a bunch of shield guys. Okay, take care of you. My god. Oh, hello. Thank you. Money or whatever this is. I'm gonna go with whatever this is. We have not seen you in a little while, my girl. Oh, are these guys armored now? Dread to think what they can do while they're armored. Luckily that armor didn't last long for you there, sir. So. 
I'm not too bad on you. Oh, another new enemy. And we currently have no magic or either. Don't know what the fuck that was. Don't care to find out. Heal up. It gives us magic as well. Lovely. Okay, he can do a try shot. What the fuck are these things? Like mice that move at the speed of fucking light. Oh my fucking life. Okay, just just wail on these two. He's got like a, a an aura underneath thing. I'm not sure if that does damage to me or something. If that's just how he summons his rats. Well, they were tricky. There's more. These areas are insane. Okay, and we got Big Boy. I think he's from the last game. The Big Boy. I remember him. I remember something that looks like him at least. You need to use that to hold enemies in place more. Okay, good. Uh, he hit me. Okay, because he can block with his shield, isn't it? If he turns enough, he can get a block in. Damn, I'm so goddamn weak. <laughs> So goddamn weak. Three chambers left. Triple pom or this? Go with the triple pom. I don't know what this other thing is. These these Roman numerals here. Oh my god! I feel so under like powered for this area. They're not actually too bad. Okay, get lightning on them all. That's the way to deal big damage numbers. Unfortunately, it doesn't quite do as much as I was hoping it would. I think it's just making sure to use a combination of everything I've got. Also, this is a long episode. Reaching an hour already. Thing is, there'll be like four more waves in this goddamn room is the only thing. And we got another one of these shield-bearing boys. And I'm taking a lot of damage from these guys as well. Okay, good. At least he's only ever doing 15 damage to me. I dread to think what sort of damage he'd be doing if it was any more than that. Right, we're near back to full HP now. Get out of here, you! I wish I could crit with this. If I could crit with this with the amount it's hitting, it'd be really, really good. Keep waiting on it until he dies. God knows how long it'll take, but keep using this until everything dies. A palm of power. More than a palm of power. Three palms of power. Oh, wait. Okay. Interesting. Right, um... This isn't great. <laughs> This isn't great. All of these aren't really what I was looking for, but I need the reroll thing. This is the best one, I guess. Could head straight for Kronos, or... 
Ah, so this is how I make my way to Kronos, and this is how I gain more power. This is a mini boss, so I'm intrigued to see what it is. And Poseidon is obviously good. Ah, so it's just this guy again, but it's the rat guy again, but these rats are fucking insane. Again, very glad he can only ever deal 15 damage to me, because I think I'd be taking a significant amount more than that if he could do any more. This, this is fucking impossible, man. <laughs> I'm clearly in way over my head right now. These rats are insane, man. They do so much damage and they're so fast. They're just picking me apart. And he's just going to summon more of them as well. That's the worst thing. Look at this. How the fuck am I meant to even hit the bloody thing? It'll just sit behind him. Chill out, rat. In comes a lot more rats, most likely. You've got a bunch of walls. Oh, man. <laughs> I just have to kind of ignore the rats for the most part. Okay. This is all it's going to be. Just slam him down with this. Stop spawning rats while I'm stunning, sunlocking you. There's so many. Like nothing I can do to avoid their damage. They just keep coming. I don't have enough AOE. Okay, I got I got time slammed as well apparently. This is fucking silly. How with a weapon like this, how am I meant to actually legitimately not get hit by these fucking rats? There'll be like a thing that's like if you take any less than three damage, you take no damage at all. That'll be really good for these, but I just can't. Like they're just absolutely wailing on me. Absolutely wailing on me. Apparently, I have a time limit in here. Don't know what that time limit was about because it happened and I killed him in time, but it seems to. Fucking these rats, man. I am way too weak for this. That was gross. Your master will fare no better. Our family scattered to the winds a bit, my niece. You've heard from those of us upon the that was gross. Zeus sent several of its children to take care of things down closer to the base. They're probably just fine. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> sure. You'll regret this. I've got eight seconds of invincibility. Best use it. It's gone. This area is fucking nuts. I mean, I love it. It's meant to be difficult, but god damn. Look at this. There's just so much going on. How am I even meant to do anything? Ugh. I've got five seconds to kill everything to get my, um, that's pretty cool. Okay, I almost did it. And I get my death to fire back, essentially, I think. Otherwise, it uses one. Money, we don't, I don't think we need money, we've got plenty. My god.
Stop blocking! Fuck! The blocking is too much. Alright, well, I, I can't wait to come back to this area and have some real damage. Because goddamn, my blitz is like the only good damage I'm dealing right now. Everything else is just shit. The blitz damage. Blitz damage is kind of ace. Okay. I know there's going to be another wave full of fucking dickheads to fight in a minute. Do I have to kill this or is this just like a... If I kill it, it's out of the way. I think it's more like that, isn't it? Oh my god. Let's take another one of these. My god, what is going on in here? Oh my god, look at the amount of these things! When there's loads of them gathered up, we actually do tons of damage because of all this chain lightning. They give us money every time as well, goddamn. I'm gonna do this now, in case I die in this room. Yeah, when enemies are all grouped up like that, it's not too bad. You deal decent enough damage. And the sooner we kill them, the more gold we get from them. Oh my god, this is intense as fuck. I'm really enjoying myself though, I have to say, I'm really enjoying myself. This struggle bus of a run here is, is quite fun. Trying to blitz everything as hard as I can. But it's just crazy how like low my damage is. Also my hand kinda hurts from playing the controller like this. I've been spamming triangle so much I've been like jamming my hand into the uh, edge of the controller. On my authority. Twelve seconds of, in of invincibility or twenty primed armor. 20 armor seems the best, but I was really hoping we get something damage related there, but sadly not. This is the only way to go. I don't even know what to think of these enemies. I don't know what they do. How to dodge them. I know that I'm impervious to them for a little bit. Not anymore, I'm not. While I was impervious, I was doing pretty well. <laughs> Okay, they are pretty rough, these things. Oh, I got a dodge there. That's kind of nice. Okay, these things actually kind of get wrecked by this. More of these rat dweller boys. I really, really don't like these guys. The rat king things, whatever you want to call them. Because the rats are just insane. There's three of them. Definitely losing a death defy here. Yep, there you go. If I can kill everything in the rest of the time left. Nah. I tried. Right, 
Right, and we're onto the boss now with very little health. I think this is the boss. Down there. My healing's very nice. Double palm's pretty good. Never got the right upgrades, really, did I? Hey, Zeus. Lightning from on high. Hey, Kronos. Okay. This is gonna go bad. <laughs> this is gonna go real bad. This has been a fun ass run, though. Didn't work. Ah. The stately house. Dive. I was not expecting that. Ah, oh, there's more enemies. Ah, welcome, my girl. Let yourself in, I see. Through the gutter. This family never had any class. Though I'm working on alleviating that within this house, if you would pardon all the dust. We have been renovating around here. Get up. You get up off that stolen throne. You know who I am, and you know why I'm here. A family with no class and no civility either. Have I not made clear to you that your attempt to do me harm shall be in vain? I am a deathless titan. You merely are a poor, misguided girl. Hear me, you enemy of night and darkness now. For your transgressions you shall imminently die. Under Chthonic doctrine, this I vow, for there is no escape from fate beneath the sky. Manners! Cursing is forbidden in this house. By that token, fighting is forbidden as well. But for you, my girl, we shall have to make an exception. Time for you to go. Okay. Behold. Death to Kronos! <laughs> Well, he has a lot of health, and we got to deal with all these bloody rat things. I don't think that's going to go sea swimmingly. Oh, okay. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, the rat things are dead at least. I can actually focus on him now. Whoa, what the fuck? Okay, that seems to block projectiles and do a lot of damage to me. Oh my god. Don't let those balls touch me. I probably should have known that already, but... Oh, okay. Anything that he leaves, don't get near it. It does damage after the facts. What are these? I don't know, but they're probably going to do a lot of damage to me if I don't destroy them. Stop sucking me in. I mean, we've done better than I would have thought with this weak-ass build. I really don't know what these are doing, so I'm going to just destroy them anyways. Ah, bollocks. There's a Death Defy gone. I think this engraved pin's kind of amazing. <laughs> I think I can just die once per room without using a death defy. It's kind of awesome. Come, my 
Oh, lovely. More of the rat things. Why is it always got to be the rat things? They're awful. Stop sucking me! God damn. I bet there's going to be some builds out there that could just annihilate this guy, but at the minute, very much do not have one of them. I mean, we've got him like a quarter of the way down already. Like I said, more than I expected. Damn it. There's a real death defy. Yeah, definitely the most defensive build we've ever had. Oh my god. Don't really know how to predict any of his attacks, to be honest, so... I'm getting a little bit better at it, but... We definitely ain't killing him this time around. Oh god, that does, that does a lot of damage. There you go, we're dead, finally! My goodness. Outcome. Nothing more. That was kind of amazing. That was kind of amazing. Oh, I had him in my grasp. Oh, let's talk to the froggy. I got all the way to Kronos, the one place I can beat him. But I couldn't do it. Not yet. Not yet indeed. Hey. Oh, hey, Mal. I was just floating. Floating around, I guess. And existing. Just kind of existing a lot lately. You Failing, making progress, I don't know. Speaking of, shouldn't you be practicing your haunting, Dora? Oh, yeah, no, I thought maybe I'd take a break from that. Why well, do now what you could do later, right? For the lazy ghost. Where's Lord Moros? I don't know where he's gone. Have I gifted to you yet? Oh, wait. Ah, different gifts, I see. I reached the house, headmistress. Did everything as practiced and as planned, except... He was too strong. No, this is an excellent result. You are still here, having learned more of what it takes to reach our enemy and what he can do to resist. Do you feel ready to continue your pursuit? Yes. Indeed. If I can reach him, I take him. Love the stuff. I can do with this cauldron. Ooh, what's this? I need pure shadow to permeate the surface wards. So what if? Three fabric. Okay, so that's that's a that shadow that I can use for other stuff here. See, so like this. Um. Restore 10% HP, we like that. Create two additional- oh yes, we definitely want to do that. The dirt piles are amazing. Thank you. We'll go for that as well. Extra healing's always going to be good. And then this is really good as well because now with this we can change over um, Let me see. between locations. We can change over our keepsake, which I don't think I'll do that often, but it's pretty useful. For example, one of the ones that's really good is you can start with uh, money and then change over to the one that gives you a life after every combat. Okay. Hello, hello. I can give you this. Back on your feet again there, princess. All's well in the crossroads. Nothing to It's fortunate we have you vigilantly keeping watch here, Nemesis. Oh, come on, drop the act. What happened? When did you return? 
I don't know what you're talking about. And it's not your business anyway. Fates help you on your task. Not quite as easy as you imagined, is it? To think that the embodiment of retribution could be so arrogant. Shut up. <laughs> report. Hello. Why not send Nemesis to the surface in my stead? Even if I undo the ward sealing the path, I don't know that I'll last long up there. The matter on Olympus isn't as personal for Nemesis as it is for you. And she hasn't been especially receptive to suggestion recently. I can see that. No, I suppose not. Some wheat. Right, good, good. Got all of those planted. Let's check what's going on over here. Still can't afford anything Just more from breathe. here. We do have enough to buy one of these, though. The champions. Set forth each night with one chance to find any minor... To, to turn any minor find into a major find. Hmm. It's kind of interesting. What's that one do? Got that one there. Likely. Okay, that's good. And random common chaos blessing. Once this night, every eight encounters replace it. Ooh. Good stuff. Okay, well, I think we're going to leave it here. I'll talk to this guy first. To fill out that keepsake storage case, young one. Fine work, yet I must caution you not to collect just for collecting's sake. The act of giving is its own intangible reward. Nectar sours when it's offered with impure intent. So I think what we can do on the next one is if I come over here. So this is level two now. I can go with... I don't know which one it is. There's one of them that lets you start with money. I don't think we've unlocked it yet, actually. I think we've got to go speak to Charon. But we can get one that's going to be better early on. And then change over late, later on. Which is kind of the best way to do it. Either way, let's leave it there. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. Very long episode, but a lot of fun. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.